Hello everybody, this is Not A Crypto Expert chiming in with another video. And in today's video, today is September the 9th, 2020. This is a current state of the cryptocurrency market, also known as a $100,000 Bitcoin watch video. But before I get into the topic of conversation for today, I would like to ask that you please consider giving me a like, giving me a heart, giving me a thumbs up, a follow, a subscribe, hitting that post bell notification. I'm not going to ask you to share because it seems invasive on my channel. I talk about cryptocurrency and blockchain technology, and I try to keep it entertaining with a beat playing in the background. So on to the topic of conversation for today, which is how far are we from the price of one Bitcoin being $100,000 or more? As of September the 9th, 2020 at 8.52 a.m., we are currently $89,816 away from the price of one Bitcoin being $100,000. Um, now, there are two things that I feel that need to happen before we achieve this. One being that the average user is using a blockchain-based application of some type and not realize that they're utilizing it. Um, well, utilizing blo blockchain technology, excuse me. Now, I did not anticipate COVID. I... It, that seems like it's going to usher in the adoption of a uh, blockchain utilization by the masses without people thinking about or realizing what it is that they're actually using. Um, you know, the other one that came to my mind was actually high, high well, I don't want to call them high-end sh tennis shoes, but um, like Air Jordans or things that Nike are making for their, or not just Nike, but other companies that are, are including these QR codes where you can scan it to verify that it's authentic. Now, I'm not sure that all of those are running on blockchain. I know that there have been like a few trials um, from some companies. I, I know that I've done a few uh, videos regarding some of the companies that were trialing some of the software for some of the uh, more exclusive shoes. Um, but that would be the first step. The average person is using a blockchain based solution and they don't realize that it's running on blockchain, be it permissioned, um, free or semi open closed whatever it's it's something that's blockchain the other uh, second thing is that the price of bitcoin is going to have to fall to 50 I, i'm predicting 1500 dollars um i'm pretty sure that it will dip slightly lower than that but i believe 1500 dollars is uh where we are going to get People are going to laugh at everyone who purchased Bitcoin. The masses will mock everyone who believed in the technology. And then the price of Bitcoin, as well as the technology itself, will rise from the ashes like the Phoenix. So with that being said, let's go on ahead and get into the current state of the cryptocurrency market. As of right now, Bitcoin is dominating 57% of the cryptocurrency market, which is pretty typical. Um, in the last 24 hours, there has been $134 billion worth of trades conducted with an overall market cap of $328 billion. Um, one thing I want to point out since the last time I've been on here, which has been a while, I will admit and I apologize for, there have been some changes to coin market cap, which I will go over in a separate video. The price of Bitcoin is currently at $10,184.74, followed by my one of my favorites, Ethereum, at $346.23, which is followed by the stablecoin doing what a stablecoin is supposed to do, being at a buck. And that is Tether, followed by XRP at $0.23. Cents. We can call it $0.24, cents. chain link currently sits in the fifth spot actually the fourth spot because i don't really consider the uh stable coins so chain link is up next with twelve dollars and 23 cents with bitcoin cash coming in at 224 dollars even after that i have not seen this coin polka dot at four dollars and 42 cents followed by another one of my favorites binance coin at 23 dollars and 42 cents and the reason why it's one of my favorites is because i uh, Binance, I like the exchange itself. After that is Bitcoin SV coming in at $170.38, followed by Litecoin at $47.60, followed by Crypto.com coin at, we will just call it $0.15, cents, which is followed by EOS coming in at $2.76. After EOS is Tron coming in at $0.03, cents, 
followed by Cordano at $0.09. Cents. Tezos is right after that at $2.52, followed by USD coin, which is a stable coin for Coinbase, which is another, uh, well, it's another exchange that I prefer for people that are starting off in the uh, cryptocurrency space. It's doing what it's supposed to do at a dollar. Stellar is right after that at, we will call it $0.08. Cents. Monero, $84.01. Followed by Neo at $17.29. Unis said Leo, also known as Leo, is coming in at $1.21. Followed by Nem coming in at, we will call it $0.13. Cents. Cosmos is right after that at $5.12. Followed by Hoibi Token at $4.66. This is a new one. Well, new to me. Uma. $15.69 followed by IOTA or IOTA, whichever you prefer, coming in at we will call it $0.28, cents, followed by AVE at $0.59 cents, with Yearn.Finance coming in at $25,129.47. Um, so that is the current state of the top 25 coins. Well, really 27 just minus the two stable coins. So... With that being said, folks, don't forget to hit that like button, that heart button, that thumbs up button, that follow, that subscribe, that post bell notification. I'm not going to ask you to share because it seems invasive. And I hope that you're having a great morning, great afternoon, and an even better evening.